Hey, what is up, everybody? My name is Rahul, and in this video, we'll be looking at a challenge called RoboSans. The description says that the flag is somewhere on the web application, not necessarily on the website. Find it out. Now, if I click on this link, you'll see that this is similar to the website that we just saw. And if I were to click on Command U or Control U, if you are on a PC, you will see that it says the flag is not here, but keep digging. Now, I mistook the digging for brute forcing for a while and what i did here was i tried to brute force in but even that did not lead me anywhere so if you see here that are there are a few directories for example the images directory the js directory from which it is pulling off the javascript files and the css directory now i thought why not try these out so css you'll see that proper permissions have been put into place and if i were to just uh, visit these uh, directories it'll give me a 403 forbidden but this is wherein I went back to the challenge and read the challenge topic. Oh, sorry, the title. It says Roboto Sans. And that is when it hit me. There is something called a robots.txt file. Generally, these are put into place to secure your websites from being crawled by a web application by bots like Google. So Google Bot or Bing. So here you will see that there is something basic 64 encoded. This cannot be base 64 encoded because you can see that there is an uh, invalid character in between. So let's just copy this part and let's just paste it. And if I were to click on from base 64, you'll see that there is a file called myfile.txt. And if I go there, you'll see that we get the flag right away. So thank you guys. This is it for the video.